Hey guys, these are my reviews of um, the best amusement parks in America while I do my hair. <laughs> um, first up, we have Kings Island. I haven't been there since I was like eight. Um, my boyfriend is always asking me to go there and I'm like, no, let's go to Disney World again. Um, from what I remember, it was like stupid and felt kind of childish. Next. Next up, we have Six Flags Magic Mountain. Um, I was there just like last week with my man and I was kind of loving it. And then I did get motion sick because we like got the, um, the thing where you can line cut. Like I think every place calls it something different, but Six Flags calls it a flash pass. And we got that and then um, like we rode too many rides too fast and then um, I felt like throwing up and like I almost did, but I didn't. Um, but I was also hungover, so that's my fault. But overall, 10 out of 10, like really good park. Next up, Universal Islands of Adventure. Um, me and Donald went on our honeymoon here like two years ago and um, he like treated me even more like a princess than usual. So I have really good memories of this place, really good rides, um, and like very romantic atmosphere. 12 out of 10. This place, I've like never heard of this and it's like on the list. I'm like, okay, why did no one tell me? <laughs> Next stop, the OG, um, Walt Disney World. Look, I'm putting on nails. Um, and this place was like the origin, the origin, sorry, of my theme park addiction. It's like the place that started it all for me when I was young. I was like, okay, if I'm not going to theme parks at least once a week, I'm gonna have depression. And so my parents helped me deal with it by taking me to theme parks all the time. And now I have a husband who takes me to theme parks literally all the time. Nobles, I don't know what this is, but they should have spelled it just with an N instead of a K. Okay, for all of us um, theme park aficionados, like Cedar Point is obviously like the Grand Slam, like takes the cake 100% of the time. It's like definitely the best. That said, that said, I um, have been there on days when I was in a bad mood and it will literally lift my mood, which to me makes it like even extra points because like a place that can do that is the best. I have just one more to review. Knott's Berry Farm. This place is amazing, underrated classic, love it, 12 out of 